moving on, you know there's that one person, two people, three people that will always start the year with a bang or rather controversy. And we are here to capture that and give you that information. Check it out. You all know Dance Hall King Conscience was in the country for his jump off concert that went down on the 31st of December at Carnival. Well, the concert happened, but some other things did happen. Bian of Saudi Soul claims that his phone was pickpocketed, car keys and other valuables that were in his jacket. He has in turn offered a reward of 50,000 Kenya shillings to the person who returns his phone. Rispa aka Ndovuku also claimed that he lost his phone, that had valuable recordings of his next music projects, and he also offered a reward for the person who brings it back. A video of ladies fighting at the VIP section also emerged, and we are just left to under how chaotic was the event. We love Dwayne Johnson as Hobbs on the Fast and Furious franchise, but sad news is that he will not be in the last movie. Dwayne and Vin Diesel have had a long-standing feud, which was brought to life by Dwayne Johnson a while back. Well, they are back at it again, and The Rock, as we all know him, thinks that Diesel is being manipulative. Dwayne had already made a choice not to return to the franchise, and according to him, they had a conversation about it in person, but recently, Vin Diesel went online and asked him not to leave the franchise because a legacy awaits him. Dwayne felt that this was manipulative because they had already talked about it in person, but he went ahead and brought it out to the public. At this point, we are sure that Dwayne is not going back for the last Fast and Furious film and that this feud is not about to end. Do you think that that was manipulative of Vin Diesel? Dr. Dre and his ex-wife Nicole Young are officially divorced and last month Dr. Dre posted a photo of him celebrating being divorced. He may be happily divorced but he has to part with a hundred million dollars. Reports indicate that he will pay his ex-wife a hundred million dollars as agreed during their divorce settlement. He will pay the money in two portions. Half of it as agreed is to be paid immediately and the other half is to be paid over the year. Well, that's quite a huge amount of money, but with an estimated net worth of $820 million, $100 million is not a lot. <laughs> 